If you're into cars and other vehicles, then you're probably familiar with the catalytic converter. Many people online have asked the question of if you can drive a car without the converter. We're here to answer that question in this video. So can you drive without a catalytic converter? The easy answer to the question is yes. Technically removing the catalytic converter will have little effect on your car's ability to run. But the more important question to ask here is should you do it just because you can? To further understand this topic, let's first talk about what a catalytic converter is and how it works. A catalytic converter is a device that is installed in your car's exhaust system to reduce the amount of harmful emissions that come out of the tailpipe. It does this by using two types of catalysts, reduction catalyst and oxidation catalyst. The reduction catalyst converts nitrogen oxide emissions into nitrogen and oxygen, while the oxidation catalyst converts carbon monoxide and hydrocarbons into carbon dioxide and water vapor. These chemical reactions occur inside the catalytic converter, which is made up of a honeycomb-like structure of ceramic or metallic materials coated with the catalysts. Driving without a catalytic converter is not recommended because without it, your car's engine will produce more harmful emissions, and that's bad for the environment. But there are other consequences to consider as well. First of all, driving without a catalytic converter can hurt your fuel economy and engine performance. Your car's engine is designed to work with a catalytic converter in place, so removing it can cause your engine to work harder, resulting in increased fuel consumption and decreased performance. Additionally, driving without a catalytic converter can trigger the check engine light to turn on. This is because your car's onboard computer system is designed to monitor the catalytic converter's performance. If it detects that the catalytic converter is missing or not functioning correctly, it will turn on the check engine light to warn you of the problem. With this error, it will be more difficult to detect actual problems when they arise, unless you can get the light to turn off. But that's not all. Driving without a catalytic converter can also make your car much louder. Without the catalytic converter, there is nothing to muffle the sound of the exhaust, so you'll hear a lot more noise coming from your car's tailpipe. And to make matters worse, without the catalytic converter, your car will also emit a much stronger smell from the exhaust, which can be unpleasant and a health hazard for both you and those around you. Finally, it's worth noting that in many places, it is illegal to drive without a catalytic converter. If your car is caught without a catalytic converter during a vehicle safety inspection, it will fail the inspection and you won't be able to legally drive your car until you get a new catalytic converter installed. Do you have experience driving a car without its catalytic converter? Let us know in the comments below.